Someone's back. Hey, guess what? Hey, my cool. Someone name is Joy. Yeah, my name is Joy. Name is Ryan. And that's Ryan. Name is Joy. And what's your name? Name is Jackson. Jackson. And guess what? We started a YouTube channel. Lightning McQueenie. And that's Lightning McQueenie. <laughs> work done. Nobody's awake yet in the house, so I'm just whispering. I am getting, I had to do a fasting, I have to do a fasting blood work test this morning, getting all my levels checked, all my hormone levels checked, and getting all my blood sugars checked, everything, the whole, the whole workup checked. So I am going to be at the blood bank or the blood work lab for two hours. A specialist who helped me with the journey with Jackson, with conceiving Jackson, is uh, going to check out all these uh, labs just to kind of see where everything's at and uh, kind of like a fresh slate, kind of just like starting over, see where everything's at and uh, yeah. It'll be good. I just need coffee, but I can't have any. I'm tired. <laughs> it's too early. It's like 6.45. <laughs> but anyways, thought I would just check in here and get started with my day and bring you guys with me. We'll go see. We're going to get ready. I got to go really quickly. I'm not even going to worry about makeup, I don't think. I'm just going to go and just show up <laughs> and just plug in my ears and drink the gross orange drink and hang out, yeah. Anyways. <laughs> Did she go to a girl party? Let's go. Mommy? 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 Well, I'm finally done. Finally done. Oh, that was a long wait. That was a long haul. Man. I just about fell asleep sitting up in the chair. <laughs> I just, uh, oh, I don't like doing those tests. They're so gross. Like, I uh, haven't had to do one in a while. And I just do not like it. <laughs> but I'm glad it's done. Jackson's been asking where I am. I'm driving Ryan nuts, probably. Poor, poor kid. He's just, he woke up and I wasn't there. So I'm going to rush. Well, not rush. I'm, I'm gonna head home and uh, go see see what he's up to. I'm debating whether to stop for a coffee though, because I, I could use one. But yeah, I need a poop, I, wow, what? <laughs> I need a pick me up, a boost. I was trying to say boost and pick me up. <laughs> but yeah, 
I'm glad that's done. I got all the lab work done. A little bit of context into this because I just, you know, it's my first vlog. So I am on the journey of, Ryan and I are on the journey of trying for baby number two. And I battle something called PCOS and it's a uh, hormone imbalance in my body that kind of like, you know, messes with that a little bit with that process. And so it's just a journey. When we were trying for Jackson, we, it took six years. And so I have no idea what, what God has in plan for this one and how long it's going to take, but I trust his timing and I trust my doctor. He's amazing. Both my doctors are amazing and I trust the journey. I trust the timing. Yeah, so this is the first step and that's kind of why I wanted to start vlogging is because like I just want to bring you guys along on the journey with me and just be real about it along the way. I've uh, been working on my health. I've I've been working on losing weight and just being healthier, just a healthier lifestyle and uh, every everything I do is for long term. It's not even just to try to have a baby. It's it's because I want to keep up with Jax. I want to have a good life. And I want to, um, I don't know. I just want to feel good. I want to feel strong. My New Year's resolution for 2024 was just to feel stronger. And so that is my, my goal is just to strengthen. And my second goal is I would like to have another baby. And I would like to complete our family with another baby. And, and Ryan as well. So I, I think this marks it's March 1st this marks the journey and the process and all of the doctors and different things that's going to be in, in involved in this process but I I'm looking forward to it I'm looking forward to it and it's going to be a good year and it's going to be fun because you know like if you're struggling with something and you're struggling with health or anything that you know you just need encouragement with. I got you. I got you. I know how hard it is. I know the the battle it is to to start. I know the battle that it is to just prioritize your health. It's hard when when you're tired, when you just feel worn out, but honestly like I I've, I've been starting to feel a lot better. I feel like I'm back. And so this is this is the journey. This is the journey. So I'm excited to be, I'm excited for this year. I just feel really good. And I, I'm, I, uh, I'm looking forward to bringing you guys along on the journey too. So I'm gonna head home. I'm gonna go see Jax and catch up with them and see what they're up to. And then, yeah, we got worship practice tonight. Um, I gotta do some meal prep. I might try and try and get some of that done because I don't have anything planned. I need to make a plan. So maybe I'll film some of that. We'll see what I can get up to. But yeah, anyways, catch you later. It's a beautiful day today. It's so sunny and warm. What's the temperature say? Five degrees. Best way to break in March. It went from like minus eight or something the other day to five degrees. I'm so jacked. I can't wait for spring. What is happening? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Where'd you go? Where'd I get you, mommy? I'm gonna get you. Yeah. I'm gonna get you. Yeah. I'm gonna get you. 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 next day so I got we went to practice last night we came home and it was about 8 39 I prepped up a bunch of chicken 
I baked it and I got it ready. It's in the fridge. I just didn't vlog that because I was tired and I just had to get it done. But I'm gonna do some meal prep today. I'm gonna do, we have a potluck at church tomorrow. So I'm gonna make a broccoli salad, like a bacon cheddar broccoli salad. And I'm gonna prep up some veggies for veggies and dip for us. I might make a chili. I'm still trying to figure out what I wanna make for supper tonight, but I gotta make a plan for tonight and tomorrow because Sundays are crazy. I never, I fail every Sunday if I don't have a plan. So I'm gonna sit down here, think about what I wanna make for tomorrow and for tonight. And then we'll prep some of that. And uh, I gotta do those dishes behind me. I've got lots of dishes to do. So I gotta get those done first. But I'm feeling so much better today. I feel refreshed. Yesterday was kind of a weird day. I was just feeling groggy and all that blood work and that juice, whatever. It was just gross. So, but today I feel a lot better and I feel like getting lots done. So that's my plan. I'm gonna get a bunch of stuff done get some prep done for tomorrow and for church and get, Ryan's gonna tackle laundry, which is awesome. But yeah, that's just our day to day. It's Saturday. Saturdays are always just like a prep for the week kind of day for us. It's the only day we can really fully do it. So that's my plan. We'll see you in a minute. What do you think, buddy? I am mommy and daddy's bed. Yeah, you're in mommy and daddy's bed. <laughs> what are you doing, handsome? Are we hanging out? Yeah, okay. Taking a little break? Yeah. Taking a break. It's a hard job being two and playing all day. So hard. I hope you feel better. He's not feeling very good today or something. He's been so calm and so quiet and so not normal like Jackie is. Hey, buddy. What do you want for supper? I want to get mommy. Yeah? Oh, what? Mommy? We want a what? I want my mommy. mommy. You want your mommy? Yeah, okay. Okay. You got me. You got me, buddy. Thank you. I know you don't. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. Oh, ow. <laughs> I know you don't. Oh, no, you don't. I get you and get you. <laughs> I get to get you. Yeah. Told you, it's all day, every day. <laughs> oh, mommy. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna prep the bacon for the broccoli salad. I'm just gonna get it on the tray. I'm gonna bake it. 375 until it's done. All right, so we got the bacon cooking. We're gonna do some roasted garlic and herb almonds. I'm going to chop those up. Those are going to go in the broccoli salad as well. So I'm going to do about a cup of those because I'm making a big batch. So let's chop those up. the nuts chopped those are done I, I chopped up a little bit extra so it turned out to be about a cup and a half of those almonds now I'm gonna grate some cheese I didn't have cheddar so I'm just gonna use marble it's okay it'll still be good with, with marble cheese I think I'm supposed to do about a cup of shredded cheese too I gotta double check that though. okay so yes I just checked this one cup of shredded cheddar cheese or marble cheese in this case so I'm gonna grate that up and then I'm gonna cut up some onions and I do one cup of red chopped onions so that's what I'm gonna do now. What do you got? I like your hat, dude. 
I like your hat. That's a cool hat. Oh no, thank you. Okay, so that ended up being a little bit more than a cup. So I just put it all. I mean, we love cheese, so I'm not worried about it. <laughs> for the bacon and then I gotta do all the broccoli. Once the bacon's cooked I'm gonna let it cool on here then we'll get the broccoli uh, prepped and chopped. This is a pro tip. This is a pro tip to make bacon. The easiest way is you bake it on parchment paper in the oven and it turns out so good every time and it's no mess. Literally no greasy stove because that is not fun. I hate cooking bacon. I absolutely hate cooking bacon. Like, I wouldn't even eat bacon if I couldn't do this. It is not, I don't know. It always bites me in the pan. I don't like that about bacon. But at least this way, all you gotta do is just let this pan cool down and then roll up the parchment paper and throw it away. You don't get it in your sink. I mean, people probably already know this. I'm probably not sharing anything new, but if you don't, you're welcome. <laughs> Now we let that bad boy cool off and then we'll throw it away. Now I'm just cutting up all the broccoli, getting that all into the bowl. I've already got like a bunch of it done because I just, you know, it's pretty monotonous. But anyways. So now I'm just prepping something for Jack's for dinner and probably for lunch tomorrow. So what I did is I cooked up a bunch of chicken breasts last night and then this is just something quick. But I like that it still has vegetables in it. You can add chicken to it and it's super easy. I just put a little bit of avocado oil in the bottom of the pan and then add the stuff and a little bit of water and I can add my own spices to it but it's got the veggies in it. He really likes those noodles once in a while thing it's cool so that's what I'm prepping now and then while that's cooking I've got to make the sauce for the broccoli salad so it's super simple ingredients it's just mayonnaise garlic powder smoked paprika a little bit of vinegar I think a little bit of salt and pepper and then it's good for that so I'll do that next okay I got Jackson fed not bad he didn't touch it. So didn't want nothing to do with it. Mm -hmm. But now I'm working on a Brussels sprout slaw. I'm gonna experiment with it. See how it how it goes. So now I just gotta figure out, am I gonna shred these with the grater? Or am I gonna cut them with the knife? With this. I'm curious what this Mommy. is gonna taste like. Mommy. I gotta use these Mommy. up. I've had them for a little bit longer than I should. Mommy. And I'm kind of sick of just garden salads, so. Yeah, I'm sick of salads that just, I love salad, but I've been eating the same kind for the past two months and I just wanna switch things up and try some new salads. So this is why I'm trying this. I'm gonna prep it for today and tomorrow. So I will let you know how this goes. I'm gonna work on some grating, see if that works. And if not, I'll just cut them. Well, nope, not doing that. I'm not gonna be grating these. Let's see if I can slice them. Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, oh my gosh, this is gonna take forever. What are you doing? Are you eating the onion? 
Um, Artie. Are you eating the onion? Um, yeah, Pokey. Oh, okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye, Bum Mommy. Bye. Bye, Jackie. <laughs> okay, so I chopped up about three quarters of what was on the thing and I just. It, it turned out pretty good, actually. Five, like for three, texture looking. Three. Pretty good. Once I got in the rhythm, it didn't take too long. And then the rest, I'm just gonna steam. Steam for just the supper tomorrow night, I guess. Or tonight, we'll see. You wanna go to sleep? And just in case anyone's gonna come at me about this knife, it is so dull. I am not gonna cut myself. I can already hear you what you're thinking. She's gonna cut her fingers off. Nope. Trust me, you couldn't even if you wanted to. This thing is so dull. I've tried sharpening it, but it does a pretty good job still. That's why I've kind of held on to it a little bit longer. But I try to always have the right technique too. Sometimes you forget. But yeah, these are dull, 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 dull. So, you don't have to worry about that. Does anybody else sit while they meal prep and just kind of like chill and just relax? Yeah. Ah! <laughs> Almost dropped it. There's probably a faster way of doing this. I just don't. I don't care right now. <laughs> this is just the way it's going. I'm really curious though how this is going to turn out. I saw this on Pinterest, this recipe. I don't know what you use for the dressing. I think it was like olive oil or avocado oil. And sweetener and kind of makes it like a sweet onion, Brussels sprout kind of thing. I don't know. We'll see. I will let you know my honest opinion on it once we sit down to eat. Probably after Jackson goes to bed. All right, well, I'm done for tonight. <laughs> I've got meal, a supper for tonight and tomorrow night. And I got potluck covered for church tomorrow. So that's pretty good, I feel pretty accomplished. I'm not sure what I'm gonna think about this salad though. I tried the dressing that the recipe said, uh, directed with it and I'm not sure, I'm not sure. I think the salad will be good, but I don't know about the dressing. <laughs> Ryan was laughing at me. So, we will give you, I'm not going to mix the dressing. I've got it made here. This is what it looks like. It's got Dijon. Dijon and avocado oil and lemon juice and garlic powder. I don't have any, I ran out of fresh garlic, so that's what the dressing is with salt and pepper. Yeah, and I'm not sure. I'm just not sure. So I don't want to wreck this salad. I'd, I'd rather it be edible. So I'm going to try it on my plate. And I'll let you know how it turns out. We got the, the broccoli salad done. The Brussels sprout salad done. The chicken prepped Brussels sprouts for tomorrow night with leftover salad. This is Jackson's to kind of, if he feels like it, poor guy's got a tummy ache, so... So this is chicken for tonight with green beans. So that's our dinner for tonight. Meal prepped, tomorrow's dinner, and then lunch we have potluck. So I don't have to worry about lunch. But yeah. Okay, what's the verdict? Oh, you're eating the beans? Okay. <laughs> beans. Try the salad. Me first. Okay. All right, let's try this. We're gonna try the salad. It's actually good when everything's all together. Okay. What do you think? Not bad. Not bad? That'd probably be really good in the summer, hey? Refreshing. Mm -hmm. 
But I could probably, what about an Asian dressing? That'd probably be really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, I think it's a hit, you guys. Yeah, but that, this was really fun. I really enjoyed meal prepping with you guys and, and it was kind of nice because then it just keeps you accountable. You have to finish it. You can't just stop halfway through, right? But I really enjoyed this. I enjoyed spending time with you and this concludes my first vlog. Thanks for coming to the, on all the excursions with me to the, the lab and all the fun moments with Jackson and for meal prepping with me. If you, if you guys like this content and if you want to hang out with me more, subscribe, give me a like, and stay tuned for what we're going to do next. Have a good day. God bless. Mwah.